Assalamu alaikum everyone. Welcome to Story Station at the Library. Kaise hain aap sab? I have a question for you. Do you like birds? Maybe you have a pet bird at home. Ho sakta hai aapke ghar mein koi parinda ho. Or maybe there are some outside in the garden or just flying past your window. हो सकता है वो आपकी खिड़की के बाहर उड़ रहे हों। Today I am going to read you two stories. Both these stories are about birds, very special birds. ये दोनों कहानियाँ परिंदों के बारे में हैं, बहुत ही खास परिंदे। लेकिन ये इतने खास क्यों हैं? They are special because they have friends, and they have friends. Who are very different to them. मजे की बात ये है कि इनके जो दोस्त हैं इनसे काफी मुख्तलिफ हैं. Let's find out more. The first story is called Small Birds Big Adventure. The story is written by Nick Mulgrew, illustrated by Wesley Van Eden, and designed by Jennifer Jacobs. When you are a baby. Starting to crawl, the whole house is an exciting new world. When you grow up, you discover that the world is a much bigger place. जब आप बड़े हो जाते हैं, आपको पता लगता है कि ये दुनिया बहुत ही बड़ी जगह है. Today we are going to read about Small Bird, his very small world, और इसकी दुनिया बहुत छोटी है. Before we read this story, let's learn some new words to help you understand it better. The first word is cage. A cage is a place where you put a bird or animal to stop it from escaping. Cage ka matlab hai pinjara. Some people think it's cruel to put animals in cages. Can you say the word with me? Cage, cage, cage. Good job. The next word is sad. You feel sad when you lose something or someone. It's the opposite of happy. Sad ka matlab hai wo daas hona. Chale ab hum saath mein bolte hain. Sad, sad. Sad. Good. Have you ever heard about giants? A giant is an imaginary person who is much bigger than a human being. Giant, just money, तौर पर इंसान से बहुत बड़ा होता है. Giant को हम उर्दू में देव कहते हैं. Let's practice saying it together. Giant. Giant, giant. You're doing great. The next word is an action. Zoo. Zoo is the past tense of fly. A bird or insect flies using their wings. Zoo ka matlab hai ur jana. Parinde or kire. अपने परों के जरिए और जाते हैं। Let's say it together. Zoo, zoo, zoo. You are doing great. The last word is jewels. I love jewels. Jewels are precious stones like diamonds or rubies. Jewels का मतलब है सेवरात। जो हम अक्सर अपने कानों में, गले में या हाथों में पहनते हैं। Do you like jewels? Can you say the word with me? Jewels, jewels, jewels. Amazing! You've learned five new words today. Now I'll tell you the story. Small bird, big adventure. Small bird was a small bird. He was very small and very birdy.
small bird lived in a beautiful house with a giant. Small bird loved the giant very much. She was a kind giant. She gave small bird lots of toys. Small bird was sad when the giant wasn't around. So one day small bird went to go find the giant. Where does small bird live? Do you think he lives in a cage? Can you see the cage now? Is the door open? Yes, it is. Small bird flew up and up until he could see the whole world. He wanted to find the giant. Where would he land? Do you really think small bird flew high enough to see the whole world? Kya aapko lagta hai wo itna uncha uda ki usse puri duniya nazar aa gayi? Small bird landed in a huge forest filled with trees and flowers and treasure. Small bird loved playing with the shiny jewels. But where was the giant? Does this look like a forest to you? There are lots of trees. But can you find jewels in a forest? Yahan par bahut saare darakht hain. Lekin kya aapko jungle mein devrat milte hain? Kya aapko wahan jewels milte hain? I think it's a bed cover and someone has left a ring and a bracelet on it. Small bird walked into a vast field of snow. The snow was white and soft. Small bird loved rolling around on the cool ground. But where was the giant? Does this look like a field of snow to you? क्या आपको ये बर्फ का मैदान लग रहा है आई थिंक इट्स अ बाथ टावर मुझे लग रहा है ये तौलिया है दिस टाइम स्मॉल बर्ड फ्लू इवन हायर इन टू द स्काई ही फ्लू अमंग द स्टार्स एंड गैलेक्सीज ही सॉ द मून ही सॉ अ कॉमेट बट वेयर was the giant Do you really think small bird could fly into space among planets and comets Kya aapko lagta hai chhota parant sayaron ke darmiyan ud raha tha Hmm maybe he's still in the house Mujhe lagta hai wo abhi bhi shayad ghar ke andar ho from way up high with his sharp birdy eyes small bird saw something what could it be can you see the giant now i think this might be the giant small bird dived down 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 where would he land small bird landed right in the giant's hand he was so happy to see her i love you giant he shrieked do you think small bird is happy to see the giant is the giant happy to see small bird can you think of a time when you were happy to see someone The giant held small bird close to her. I love you too, the giant said. Look at this picture carefully. 
कैन यू सी द फॉरेस्ट एंड द स्नो क्या आप जंगल और बर्फ देख सकते हैं कैन यू सी द वर्ल्ड कैन यू सी द प्लान क्या आप सयारे देख सकते हैं hmm, where has the bird been all this time? Yes, inside the house. For the small bird, the house is a universe. छोटे परिंदे के लिए उसका घर उसकी पूरी दुनिया उसकी पूरी कायनात है That's the end of the first story. Would you like to make a bird like the one in the story? How about you follow along for an exciting craft activity? Now we're going to make a bird like the one in the story. You need some thick paper in different colors, scissor, glue, pencil, and a stapler. Remember to always ask an adult to help you if you're using scissors. Here is a bird I made earlier. मैंने पहले से एक कागजी परिंदा तैयार कर लिया है. To make the bird, you first need a paper model. You can use scrap paper for this. First, I'm going to draw the shape of the bird's body and use this piece of paper for the beak. For the next step, we need to draw a straight line using a scale. You can either use a big scale or a smaller one. Once you're done, you draw the bird's feet. And then the bird's belly Ske baad hum ek choti si line banayenge bilkul lambi line ke niche I'll draw a line where its wings are going to go just like that Now I'll use this yellow paper and draw two small triangles for its beak. Ab hum parinde ki choch banayenge. I'm using a scale for this step and drawing two equal triangles. Koshish kare ki dono triangles barabar ho. I'm going to cut this with a pair of scissors. कैची इस्तेमाल करने से पहले आप अपने घर के बड़ों की मदद लें आई कट द फर्स्ट ट्राइंगल नाउ मूविंग ऑन टू द सेकेंड वन यू कैन यूज वेरिएशन ऑफ कलर्स फॉर द पी आई एम डन विद द सेकेंड ट्राइंगल एंड वी हैव टू सेट ऑफ ईच Use the bird template and cut it out. Make sure to cut along the curve and the line. I'm being extra careful while cutting the template and I would advise you to do the same. आप अपनी आसानी के लिए कागज को अपनी तरफ घुमा सकते हैं ताकि आपको कट करने में मुश्किल ना हो अब इस लाइन को मैं सिजर से कट करूंगी बिल्कुल इसी तरह आपने भी कट करना है Here is the shape of the bird's body. Fold a square piece of thick colored paper in half and make sure you divide them equally. 
कोशिश करें कि आपका कागज बराबर हिस्सों में तकसीम हो As you can see, this looks equal from both sides. You place the model on top and cut out the shape of the bird. You can ask an adult to help you. Make sure you cut along the curve so that it can match the paper model. हम पहले की तरह इस कागज को कट करेंगे Be careful. You can see that both of them look identical by now. Dono ek dusre ki tarah lag rahe hain. By folding the bird slightly, you can cut a hole for its wing like this. अब इस छोटी सी लाइन को कट करेंगे बिल्कुल इस तरह I'll take another piece of thick paper in a different color. अब हम कागज का एक मुख्तलिफ रंग लेंगे आप देख सकते हैं मैंने इस कागज को पहले से दो हिस्सों में कट कर लिया है This should be the same as the first piece. This time, fold it carefully like this. I am folding this piece of pink paper in an accordion fold. These are the bird's wings. ये परिंदे के पर हैं जिसके जरिए वो उड़ते हैं याद है आपको Choose whichever color you want for the main wing. This step is really important. So make sure you fold it carefully for a better result. Press the paper hard to maintain the shape of the accordion fold. You then fold them in half and press it tightly. Now You have to put them through the slit, the cut we previously made. You might find it a bit difficult. That's okay. Take your time. You will probably have to fan out the wings to make it look nice. It's time for the next step. Repeat the process again with another piece of colored paper for the tail. Ab hum parinde ki dum banayenge aur hum wapas is kagaz ko fold karenge bilkul pehle ki tarah. I'm using pink. You can choose any color you want. Aap apni pasand ke rang istemal kar sakte hain. bend the folded paper in half and cut the center of the fold to make two pieces staple the two parts of the tail to the bird i have stapled the first piece 
And now it's time to staple the remaining piece. Now you have to staple the other piece. Our parinda is so much You will probably have to fan out the wings and tail to make it look nice. आपको परिंदे के पर और तुमको फैलाना पड़ेगा ताकि ये और खूबसूरत लगे। Once you have stapled the paper wings and the tail section to the end of the bird's body, you move on to the beak. Finally, the triangular beak. You can stick this to the bird with glue. Simply glue them together on each side of the bird's face. Aap glue ke zariye isko chipka sakte hain. Pehle wale ke baad dusre hisse par glue lagaye aur phir isko parinde par chipka le. Your hands might be sticky by now, but that's all right. You can wash them later. Use another piece of paper for the bird's belly. Aap rang bar rangye kaagas par rinde par chip ka sakte hain. Aur apni pasand se usse sad ja sakte hain. Make sure it's the same size as your existing paper model. You can stick this to the bird with glue and press it hard. आप कागज के दोनों तरफ ग्लू लगा सकते हैं। ग्लू लगाने के बाद इसको अच्छे से चिपकाएं। This is a very important step, so make sure you glue the paper properly. You can draw or stick on the bird's eye. You can use patterned paper if you like and add color to your bird. You can make lots of different birds. To give to your friends and family. I hope you had fun making your own paper bird. Now I'm going to tell you another story. Who is our friend? The story is written by Jade Matthewson, designed by Lara De Groot, and illustrated by Gerard Fenwick. Let's look at some. Animals. Here we have a crocodile, zebra, giraffe, and rhino. They all have a best friend who is another animal. Who do you think it might be? आपके ख्याल में ये कौन हो सकता है? A lion, a hippo, maybe a snake. I'll give you a clue. It's an animal we have already met today. ये एक ऐसा जानवर है जिससे हम आज मिल चुके हैं. Let's sing a song to find out. Would you like to join in? After each verse, when I wave my hands, I want you to sing. Who is our friend? Who is our friend? Let's practice. I wave my hands and you sing Who's our friend? Who's our friend? Let me hear you again. Fantastic. Okay, here we go.
so he has a short neck no teeth he's soft and warm and he sings uski choti si gardan hai uske koi daant nahi lekin wo bahut hi surila hai who is our friend hamara dost kaun hai a snake a lion a monkey i don't think so he sings so maybe he's a bird yes it's a bird there's a reason why the bird is their best friend can you think why is it because he's sweet or gives them advice or maybe he's fun to be with let's find out who is our friend can you guess who our best friend is he's not like us at all our best friend is bird I am rhino. I get covered in fleas. Bird eats them all up. So the bird eats his fleas. आपको पता है fleas क्या होते हैं? Flea एक ऐसा कीड़ा है जो अक्सर जानवरों की खाल में पाया जाता है. So you might spot them in warm-blooded animals. such as dogs or cats do you have a best friend who eats fleas no of course not but birds like to eat insects and fleas oh yeah crocodile i can't brush my teeth but fix them all clean So the bird cleans his teeth. I wouldn't like to clean crocodile's teeth. It looks a bit dangerous, doesn't it? Mujhe to waise hi magar mujhe bahut dar lagta hai. I am giraffe. I can't scratch my head. But can we just the right spot? So the bird scratches her head. Would you like someone to scratch your head for you? Well, it might be quite nice. I am zebra. I can't see things far away. Bird has great eyes. So when he's watching, I'm safe. So the bird sees things from far away. Maybe watches for lions who might want to eat the zebra. Hamara parinda door se cheeze dekhta hai aur shayad zebra ko mehfooz rakhta hai dusre janwaron ke shikar se. Bird might be different, but that's no problem. We don't even mind when he sings. Why is the bird different from other animals? Yes, the bird has wings. Uske paas par hai urne ke liye. The bird has only two legs. Other animals have four legs and a beak. Uske paas choch bhi hai and he sings. वो बहुत ही सुरीला गाता है इज इट अ प्रॉब्लम इफ ही इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम अदर एनिमल्स नो इट्स गुड बिकॉज ही कैन डू थिंग्स दैट अदर्स कैन डू उसके पास अपनी खूबियां हैं ओ वेट अ मिनट आई थिंक द जो रॉफ इज सेंग समथिंग टू यू शी सेंग विल यू बी माई फ्रेंड 
Will you be my friend? Will you be her friend? Yes? That's fantastic! Now the giraffe is really happy. She might even ask you to scratch her head. Let's say goodbye to all our new friends. Goodbye giraffe! Goodbye rhino! Goodbye zebra! Goodbye crocodile! Before we say goodbye, let's think a little about what we do for our friends. हम अपने दोस्तों के लिए क्या करते हैं? Well, I give my friend a birthday present. Sometimes she listens to me when I'm really sad, and sometimes I listen to her. जब मैं उदास होती हूँ तो वो मेरी बातें गौर से सुनती है. और जब वो उदास होती है तो मैं उसकी बातें सुनती हूँ आई माइट इवन लैंड हर अ शॉल और अ ब्रेसलेट वट डू डू फॉर योर फ्रेंड आप अपने दोस्तों के लिए क्या करते हैं डू यू प्ले क्रिकेट विद दैम और हेल्प दैम विद देयर होमवर्क आई होप यू एंजॉय दिस एपिसोड ऑफ स्टोरी स्टेशन एट द लाइब्रेरी कैच एस नेक्स्ट वीक for more fun and learning goodbye alafiz